them always see the night. They say they want a real one. They say they want a real one to make them feel young. Hey yo, what's good family? Welcome back to Astro Nori for another video. Today we're gonna be covering the week six collaboration. That's all we have so far. It is the Smurfs collab. And I feel like this shit is hard, bro. I'm gonna go ahead and talk about every piece. If you guys do end up enjoying this video though, go ahead and slap a fat like on it down below. Subscribe to the channel if you are new and would enjoy more of this type of content. And I'm also really excited to announce that I am starting a giveaway with the homie Supreme Ricks. You can go ahead and follow him on Instagram. We're actually gonna team up to give away this Supreme Nueva Yolti in the size large navy and we're also gonna give away supreme playing cards there's gonna be two different winners if I'm not mistaken and you can have the chance to win one of these items right here all you have to do is click the gleam link at the top of the description it's simple bro subscribe to my channel follow him on Instagram leave a like on this video show some love to his stuff but we are doing it through gleam that way it is monitored through there and the chances are fair let's go ahead and get straight into this video so we literally have five items from the collaboration there's another item that i feel like will be dropping it's just not on this drop list as of yet but i will be covering that in a little bit i'm gonna go ahead and start from the bottom of this list with this varsity leather jacket honestly we never saw this one on the lookbook but it is better than the one that we saw drop already i actually am a fan of this one you got that big supreme branding on both sleeves i feel like this one will do good as far as resale goes especially down the road bro i just hope that the price for this jacket isn't through the roof i feel like it will be around 398 428 something around there which is hella steep but thank god that this is not a vanson collaboration because this jacket would have been like a thousand nine hundred and ninety eight dollars and nobody got time for that bro ain't nobody got time for that like that's not happening on this side i feel like the jacket in general is pretty sick though it has that 94 behind the smurf right there then you got the supreme on both sleeves i feel like it's clean i'm just not an advocate of leather jackets too much like when i go in the closet and grab a jacket i'm not grabbing a leather jacket like them shits are heavy as shit and i feel like this is cool but i just don't know bro for the price i definitely will be skipping on this piece we do have this smurfs hooded sweatshirt which isn't that bad bro i just wish that the design on this wasn't tonal bro if the design on the back of this sweater had some type of coloring on the piece it would be hard bro and i can almost guarantee you that it would have resell but considering the fact that it is tonal and you can't really see what's going on on there unless you like really get close to it it honestly just doesn't make sense i feel like it would have been a super clean piece i feel like this would have done really good resell wise and it would have just been a nice piece to have in the collection had it been not tonal type shit but the cream colorway is i the black one is too even that blue one is clean i just don't know if i'll be going for this piece it's gonna go for 158 to 168 that's the ballpark that i feel like it'll drop at we also do have this smurfs crew neck this one is like the all over smurf print there's a white one and then there's a black one and both of these actually have like a different character on the front of these pieces i believe one of them is grumpy and then the other one is clumsy i might be wrong on that but i do feel like colorways do have a different character on it which is pretty clean if i was to go for this piece i'll probably end up going for the black you know me i feel like this one might do good down the line it does have that supreme going all across it which is i i honestly will be sleeping on this piece but i still think it is pretty cool now we're gonna get into two of the pieces that i definitely got a cop this upcoming week one of them being the smurfs beanie this shit is fire bro i believe that's grumpy or like the funny one hanging out the hat from the top that's so clean dude and then on the back you have the supreme logo this is fire bro i honestly would wear it with the supreme logo on the front and then have that smurf on the back that's just so clean in my opinion i love that yellow colorway the black and the camo are fire as well i don't know how i feel about the white one it looks clean when it's clean but y'all already know what happens when it's dirty that shit gonna be greasy bro like nah but as far as resale goes i feel like that hat might do good but who knows at the end of the day this is kind of like the cat in the hat collaboration and i don't remember how those are doing now they might have one up who knows i honestly kind of want to buy that beanie now that i really think about it this smurfs one might end up doing good in the long run it's kind of those collaborations like the tom and jerry one they did cat in the hat which we just spoke about it's kind of in that ballpark of cartoons and those typically end up doing good 
as time goes on. This piece right here caters to people who love Smurfs, and then it also caters to people who love Supreme individually, so it might end up doing good, who knows. The last piece that I do wanna cover is the Smurfs skate deck. This Smurfs skate, <laughs> this shit sound crazy. This Smurfs skate deck is fire, bro. I honestly love that purple one. The black, yo, every color is hard. This is like my main priority this week. Honestly, if I miss out on everything else, I would love to have that skate deck because once I get my own place, I'm kind of like racking up all these decks to have like a wall full of decks. Okay full of decks hey yo what the fuck full of decks that's just gonna be that shit sound crazy but i'm trying to have a wall full of skate decks and i feel like it will look clean but this skate deck right here is definitely a vibe i can see resale going on i can see a whole lot of shit this one might sell out really quick you have that supreme branding old on the front of it with the little smurfs dude on the corner this is a fire piece retail is gonna be like 58 dollars around that ballpark and i feel like it's definitely worth it my favorite two pieces from this week definitely Definitely have to be the beanie and the skate deck now i am going to talk about the fact that we might see a possible t when i read the article on the supreme website it does say that there's a t included in the smurfs collaboration i don't know if it's going to drop this upcoming week or maybe when the fall tees drop i hope that they drop it this week and if they put the same logo that's on that skate deck on the front of a t it's over bro that shit is going to have resale hands down i am a fan of that logo more than anything the one on the skate deck so if they do bring that and put it exactly on a shirt that would be bananas bro but that kind of does it for the collaboration i'm gonna cover a couple more items that don't really have to do too much with this week but it is some heat that's supposed to be dropping i do want to say that if you guys are interested in boosting your chances at buying supreme you should definitely go ahead and check out addict.io they are a bot which does cook up for certain people every week obviously you won't be able to cook up every single week not even the best bots are able to but this is a chance to just increase your chance Chances. I would honestly recommend you guys to go manual and run addict at the same time that way you do have a higher chance at getting some of these items they do cover like 85 plus stores from supreme bape kit undefeated and a bunch more if you guys are interested in checking them out all you have to do is click the link at the top of the description and join their newsletter once they do restock which I feel like if they do this will be the last one for a little while you do get notified so definitely go ahead and just give them a shot check it out and see what's up bro if you end up liking it you know what to do but i will leave them linked at the top of the description if you are interested also if you have any questions just shoot me a dm about it and i will get that answered but let's go ahead and talk about these supreme jordan ones bro these shits are crazy bro i'm not gonna lie whenever they drop these summer 2021 shit is gonna be shut down like jordan ones have been like the holy grail of sneakers especially at this time dunks and jordan ones are it right now now and i feel like these jordan ones which is basically inspired by a dunk from supreme these are gonna go crazy bro that chicago colorway is gonna go for racks i'm paying whatever resale is at first i don't even care bro if it's 700 i'm paying it up front because i'm gonna need these shits that carolina blue color almost like that unc jordan one color honestly i could care less about the orange one but i feel like a lot of people will lean towards that one because there's not a lot of jordan ones in that that hue of orange i feel like it's fire bro i'm super excited about this collaboration and i just want to see what happens bro i'm honestly amped about this one today we actually got a leak for the shadow jordan ones 2.0 which are supposed to release 2021 if you guys know the shadows are one of the iconic jordan one colorways so the fact that they're bringing these back in a 2.0 which is kind of the colorway reversed is a banger bro like i'm down for this one right here shadows are the jordan one that you could wear with anything and everything so the fact that they're trying to bring these back i'm down bro like bring it back in a different tone or whatever i'm cool with it like they're just flipping the black with the gray a little bit and i'm down with this shit there is also suede wherever the gray is these look fire bro so the last bit of news that i want to cover in today's video is the fact that gucci is going to be collaborating with the north face i don't know exactly what's coming out of this collaboration but i'm hoping that it is some heat for the culture one time i feel like i probably 
probably wouldn't end up going for this shit because prices are probably going to be extravagant. I would hope that it's North Face prices because they're probably going to use their apparel. But at the end of the day, Gucci could do whatever they want. They could honestly upsell these prices and put them through the moon. And that's probably what will end up happening. I'll keep you guys covered on this collaboration in general. I do feel like they're going to do good though. I just don't know. Like if it's only the green with the red stripes, that straight ass, if they do come up with like a special design, that would be pretty fire. And I'm interested in seeing what's up with it. But that pretty much does it for this video. If you guys did enjoy, slap a fat like on it down below. Subscribe to the channel if you are new. Please make sure you go ahead and click that gleam link at the top of the description if you're interested in winning some supreme playing cards or this supreme tee in a size large. Definitely go ahead and check that out. And once I get to 20,000 subscribers, I will be giving away a bandana box logo tee. I'm gonna start that giveaway when I hit 20k. So make sure you subscribe down below if you are gonna want a chance at winning a bandana box box logo t that's probably the biggest giveaway i've done thus far and hey i just want to show some love to you guys for always supporting the channel but with all that being said i'm gonna catch you guys on the next one peace stay up and i'm out